Hi, I'm Tony. Welcome to Sports Bike Shop's video about the Scorpion XO520 air helmet. This is Scorpion's new for 2021 sporty helmet and it costs £169.99 in plain black or it's £209.99 in graphics like this air shade design. The XO520 Air runs a polycarbonate shell which contributes to a weight of 1609 grams. That's for this size medium helmet as weighed on our scales. That is slightly on the heavy side for a sporty helmet but lids with plastic shells like this one do tend to weigh a little bit more, so it's not a big surprise that it's come in at that number. The venting on the 520 Air is simple and it's effective. There's a chin vent under the visor here that's very glove friendly and it reveals two openings for air to flow through to the inside. There's another chunky slider on the top, this one here, which reveals four holes, the two in the middle just here and then two more on the flanks of this vent area. Each of those has a corresponding hole that runs through to the interior of the helmet. And once the air's flowed inside and come down into the interior, there are channels in the EPS that allow the air to flow from front to back. And then it comes out through exhaust vents just under this rear spoiler here. The visor for this helmet, it's quick release. It's the same as used on Scorpion's really, really popular XO1400 air helmet. And it is really quick to both remove it and to refit it. This one is protected against mist by a Pinlock 70 insert, which is the middle grade of Pinlock's anti-mist protection. The visor lifts and locks on this central tab here. The idea is that you give it an extra push to lock it down, or you can leave it slightly latched for air. In my experience of using this helmet, it takes a great deal of care to be able to close the visor without locking it in place. While you're riding, it's not quite so easy to do as, I, as it is when I'm stood here in the studio. The main visor is backed by Scorpion's Speedview visor. That's their internal sun visor, which operates on this side slider switch just here. And what you also need to do with this is the last little push up there has a click that locks it in the up position and stops that visor dropping down so it just slightly covers your view. That sun visor is also anti-mist coated, which is a really handy feature as it means you'll get clear vision on chilly mornings when you've got low sun, while some other helmets have sun visors that will fog up in those kind of conditions. The interior for this helmet, it's Scorpion's Quick Wick 2 Comfort Liner. It's soft, it's supple, it's antibacterial, and it's quite good at managing moisture if you get too warm while you're riding. It's easy to take it out. There are emergency release cheek pads, and there's also a handy feature that only Scorpion seems to have persevered with over the years. It's called Air Fit. And what that entails is it means there are inflating pockets of air that sit behind the cheek pads. And by just pushing a pump on the inside of the chin bar here, it moves those cheek pads slightly closer to the face and gives you a tighter fit. There's also a brass button just to the side of the pump that means you can relieve the pressure afterwards. That does seem a bit of a gimmick, but when you listen or you read the customer reviews from people who have AirFit equipped helmets, a lot of them find that operating that system means they can get a better seal around the neck and reduce the wind noise while they're riding. There are also pockets behind the cheek pads that leave room for intercom speakers. This helmet is designed for Scorpion's Exocom units. There's a cover just on the side that you can remove and then you click the control unit on there and there's also a housing in the back where you can stow the battery. If you buy the separate Exocom unit, then the price on that at the moment is £167.99. If you don't want the hassle and you want to save a few quid, very soon there will be an XO520 Smart Helmet which is on the way and that comes with the speakers and the wiring pre-installed. You get the battery and the control unit in the box so you just pop those in place and you're away. The XO520 Smart Helmet is only going to be available in matte black and it will cost £299.99. So if you like that colour and you want comms you can save yourself 40 quid or so over the price of buying the matte black lid and then separately purchasing the comms system. Something about this helmet that may disappoint those people who want something that's completely and utterly sporty is the strap fastener. It's a micrometric buckle rather than the D-rings that lots of sporty and racing riders prefer. But still, it's ACU Gold approved, so you can use this on the track and for racing. It's also ECE 2205 approved for the road. Though it's not been tested by Sharp as we record this video, but then in fairness, it's only just come out, so they wouldn't have had a lot of time to do those impact tests and reveal their star rating. I hope that tells you everything there is to know about the Scorpion XO520 Air. 
but if there is anything you'd like to ask or to add, then please pop a comment below. Thanks for watching.